Kafoka, what happened to us healthy Norwegians? How did we become some of the fattest people in Europe? It can't be due to our mat pocket, our lunch mat pocket, this frugal little thing here. Or can it? A traditional Norwegian lunch mat pocket is made like this. Two open slices of very dry bread and never made like a sandwich. With two different spreadings or toppings on it. You start with a hint of butter and then you take out one slice of tasteless sweaty cheese. And on the other one you have a thin spread of maybe liver pate. Then you separate both uh, slices with in-between paper and then you wrap the whole lunch up in paper. The most boring lunch in the world, Matpaket! We are in Norway and it's finally lunch. Are you looking forward to it? Uh, no, well you don't do that in Norway. That's not lunch here in Norway. Let's see what mom uh, gave to me. A box? I don't understand. Uh, uh, is this the... <laughs> well here, I, I, I know this. This is our matbag guy, yeah, look. This is our frugal... But there's something more, okay. Something off here. Yeah, but, yeah I don't understand this, okay. Well, this is your uh, typical mud pocket, extremely boring, nothing to look forward to, tasteless, sweaty cheese. Uh, wait, what? Okay, first open sandwich with spread or toppings on. Oh, I think it's tube cheese with cheddar and chorizo. That's a new one for, that's a new spreading for the mud pocket. That's quite off, isn't it? But I'm shocked how much spread she has on. Hmm. There must be something wrong. And this one here? Chocolate? In a Norwegian frugal mat pakke. Oh my god. And what kind of chocolate is this? Is it Nutella? No. It's like... What? Norwegian national chocolate? What's happening? And, well, no, it's not the chocolate, okay, I understand, but they just released a new spreading from our national chocolate to this spreading topping chocolate, and this we're supposed to have in our mat pocket? Well, okay, well, it probably tastes good. Very good. Too good for a Norwegian lunch. At least there are only two slices of open bread. So apparently we have the same lunch and it's tasty, very tasty. My whole body is shaking. Something's wrong in the kingdom of Norway. And, and, and for, for, let's say, a tube cheese like that, you could have some add-ons. You could have uh, some slices of cucumber. You could have some slices of to tomato on it. Or maybe one carrot, and that was it. But look what mama brought me in my... And look at this, a plastic. Where is Norway in it? And what? Add-ons? I'm not... Uh, I'm not living in Rome 2,000 years ago. I'm not, I don't understand. All two flat peaches? No. What is this? Triplet chocolate bar? No. You kidding me? More chocolate? Caramel choco soft protein bar. Caramel? Is this how a new Norwegian lunch looks like? Well, suddenly it springs to my mind. It's not strange at all that I'm becoming fat. And what happened to Norwegians? Why? This is so too much good. Yeah, this is, this is very sinful. This is like greedy. 
sweetness, it's lust, it's, I mean, this looks like really a Christmas meal for me. Every day. And this is not a lunch, a mat pakke. I, I used more than five minutes to eat my lunch, more than half an hour. And you thought this was the new older lunch? Oh no, I got more news for you. Just wait till next... Uh... <sighs> and next chapter of this very fat Norwegian story. Well, it's only been an hour. I've been in there in the school and I'm still full from that... That lunch? I don't understand. But hey, you thought that was finished? All this chocolate and all? No, it's not. Because now, one hour later, there's another trait among us Norwegians. What do you think that is? We have a passion. Oh, and mom yeah. sent a me... Alcohol. Yeah, well, <laughs> cigarettes and alcohol. Well, it could have been. But now, uh, my mom actually sends me something that we call school bread. Listen to the name, school bread. That has to be some uh, very nutritious, frugal, uh, low calorie sort of things. S school bread. <laughs> this is Norwegian school bread and it's not frugal. The name, it's to deceive you. School bread, my peep. And you know what? It's not only one. Because all over Norway, wherever you are, in gas station, in a chosk, in a um, grocery store, you will find three for one or two for one. So my mom didn't send me only one school bread. She, of course, bought two because it was an offer. It was on sale. So eat them. We have become lustful, we have become greedy, and does this point to some fundamental change in Norway? I think so. Well, if you want to know what they are, stay tuned. And guys, let us know which item in our new hedonistic lunch did you really appreciate. And if you like it, push like so we can spread this video. If you haven't subscribed, do it now, because I can't do anymore. I'm too filled and instead of going right home, I need, oh, 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 I need to lay down and oh, that cheddar chorizo tube oh, mixed with those grapes. Oh, oh, oh my God. <coughs> oh.